I remember the day like it was yesterday. It was afternoon time. 2014 at that time, I used to have my own cell phone number um, on our website. And I got a call. An unknown number. So I pick it up. Hello, Vishal Sarkar. Hi, Vishal. My name is uh, Snigdha Poonam. I'm from Times of India. Got a minute? I said, sure. What is it about? She said, you know, we have been following you for the last six months and we see that you provide the most practical public speaking course. We have, you know, got some reviews from about, you know, a few hundred people who uh, rate your speaking course as the number one. We want to feature you. And at that time I said, what took you so long to call me? She said, I'm sorry. I said, I've been waiting for your call and uh, I've been waiting to be featured because I know, I knew someday you guys would call me. Times of India. Yeah. She said, yeah, we want to do a full page article on you and I said yeah sure and she said when can we schedule an interview with you I said now she said now I said now she said no we can send you some questions maybe you can prepare I said I don't need to prepare for this I am prepared for this I don't get ready I stay ready and I shared this with you to tell you that the article was written and uh, from that entire you know they featured I did not write it's not that just like a lot of people these days they they pay to be featured on stage they pay to be featured in a magazine and just so you know many times you'll see a lot of quotes saying oh I just got featured in in here in here check out the credibility you know for example places like Forbes and many other media channels they charge you about ten thousand dollars just to feature your name so that you can say I was featured you are not featured you paid okay that's what most people do to to say that oh here is what I've done so but back in the days and even today whenever you know that was my first like big uh, media um, feature and that happened that gave me a lot of satisfa satisfaction and I you know just from that thing I mean oh my god uh, we had a new problem we got about 2,000 phone calls in the next few days from people CEOs vice president saying hey we have read your article you know the feature we want to be trained by by you and that's when we had to really get everything to we, we scaled out our team I couldn't take the calls anymore the reason I shared this with you is because in life if you get ready uh, you might miss a lot of opportunities but you have to stay ready stay ready for great speeches stay ready with for like for example tomorrow if you get a phone call um, from Microsoft or Bill Gates or whoever okay saying Elon Musk hey we want you to come and share your message about finance or operations or or how to manage better how to lead better and let's say they come and say can you do it tomorrow you cannot say oh my god I'm not prepared because you don't you shouldn't get ready you have to stay ready does that make sense to you so if you are a leader and you want to learn the secrets of public speaking so that you can stay ready so that you can speak spontaneously with structure with style with confidence with power then you must know the secret formula and you do that so that you can achieve financial freedom you can dominate in your career and you can thrive you can capture you can satisfy the needs of the audience and thrive in your career and flow and empower the audience and you speak in a manner that the audience you know devours your speech just like a just like a dog jumps on food a hungry dog the audience should jump on your speeches that's my tip for you right now Vishal Sarkar here reminding you that public speaking is not about perfection it's all about connection if you want to know more call this number see you a closer deal uh, for my organization which is uh, till date the biggest deal in India what is the what is the size of the deal it's few million dollars he has some special quality to see the drawbacks the thing which you want to improve in you and he does it automatically without you knowing it that he is doing it i have decided that he is the mentor for my life at office i had a candid discussion with one of the non performing employees and had a good discussion with my manager regarding my development earlier these are very uncomfortable topics for me so before this program i used to struggle with lack of confidence while speaking but after joining this program i have increased my confidence level by five times imagine